Hi, I'm Jamie for Guitarist Magazine. Now anyone with a serious interest in um, quality acoustic guitars will know the name of Loudon. Um, it's an Irish manufacturer who has made guitars for everyone from Richard Thompson to um, Pierre Ben Susan, really super, super guitarists. Choose Loudon, um, then they're very high-end guitars. We've got two Loudon models here that are kind of in step with the current trend for smaller bodied acoustics. So we've got the S23, S standing for small, smaller bodied, and the WL25, which um, the, the WL refers to Wee Loudon, which is um, kind of a, an, a, an informal name for um, the smallest of the body sizes that you'll typically see. Um, the couple I've got here, um, despite being small in size, are using absolutely top flight materials. They're premium, premium quality guitars. Um, there's another feature about them which is uh, worthy of note, which is that they're both 12 frets to the body design. So the significance of that is that when you effectively move the neck further into the body, so it meets at the 12th fret, um, the positioning of the bridge kind of steps back more into the absolute centre of the soundboard. And a lot of people feel that this gives a more resonant, um, lively voice as a result because it's it's slap bang in the middle of the of the guitar's speaker, if you like, uh, and transferring the energy there. So that's the premise of these guitars. Um, both of them have a kind of uh, voice which belies their small size in being um, really uh, more expansive than you might expect. So let's start with this S23. First of all, you've got um, a 12 frets of the body neck, as mentioned, there's 18 frets in total. Ebony fretboard, um, you've got a nice rosewood face plate there. Um, Goto 381 tuners on there. Red cedar top, um, anyone familiar with Loudon will know that um, they're big fans of using cedar and it certainly sounds absolutely delightful on here. Walnut back and sides. Um, it's not a material you'll see on every acoustic guitar, but it's certainly one that does have a, a, a bit of tradition and heritage behind it as a, as a body material. Sounds great in this context. And it's got sycamore binding here. I'll just turn this around gently so you can see this beautiful figured um, sycamore binding here. It goes around there. Um, if we turn it over, just very gently here, you can see that there's actually two rosewood strips that um, go the length of the neck and then flare out beautifully into the heel here. Um, adding an extra measure of stability, I would imagine, and um, also looking fantastic. And coming back to here, we've got a rosewood bridge, bone saddles, as you can see, we've got a sort of two split design there for better intonation, bone nut. And uh, on these particular two guitars, there's no pickups fitted, but um, because Loudon's a, in part a kind of two order maker, you can specify with them with the pickup system that you want, and you can also choose different top materials um, and back materials if you want to go really high-end, super high-end. Um, you can choose a, a Adirondack and, uh, for the spruce for the top and Coca Bolo for the back, um, but it, that gets very expensive. So um, they're, they're by no means um, entry-level guitars to begin with. And um, So that's the S23. Let's take a little look at the um, WL25. Okay, and as if by magic, here is the WL25, um, even smaller still. Um, still 12 frets to the body, 18 frets in total. Bone nut and uh, saddles, rosewood bridge. But this one has, as you can see, a really beautiful Indian rosewood, East Indian rosewood body. So it's a slightly different material. Red cedar for the top. Um, and again, this has got a slightly shorter scale, um, 24 inches as opposed to 24.8 for the um, S23. Um, no pickup, as mentioned before with this, ebony fretboard. Again, a guitar that really um, belies its size with a, with, a, with a surprisingly full voice, but unsurprisingly, the S does have a slightly bigger bass and um, a, a different voice to this very small bodied guitar, which is almost sort of parlor-like. Um, both guitars, as mentioned, this is a, a premium maker. Everything's completely handmade with years and years of experience behind it, but um, that's reflected in the price. They're both around £3,400. Um, so a serious investment, but um, a lifetime investment in a guitar that you could keep that would only get better and better with age. So if you're very serious about your acoustic tone, um, Loudon 
is definitely a port of call for you. And these two small body guitars should certainly not be overlooked for uh, being diminutive in size because they have so much music in them. Um, and uh, so let's have a listen to them now and you can hear for yourself. <laughs> Thank you. 